Okay, Ronaldo just had a fight in training with his new teammate Erling Holland, and afterwards, Xabi Alonso suspended both for two weeks. But this may have actually been a good thing because afterwards they had a little talk, and then on their return, they pretty much played the best football of the season so far. So this problem has maybe been solved, and now we look to push on and climb the La Liga table. As well as in today's episode, this year's Ballon d'Or winner will be announced. So drop a like down below, and let's get straight into it. Now we start today off with a tweet saying that reports from Madrid are saying Ronaldo and Holland have mended their relationship as teammates that both are moving forward following their fight in training which is some uh, very good news for Real Madrid fans now first comment you should take over the career of a young player like uh, Jude Bellingham or Rico Lewis yeah I mean a Jude Bellingham Kermo doesn't sound like a bad idea and whether it's like a full series or like a one-off video I think we will do that at some point and now next one you should take over a championship level club and make them win the Champions League yeah I want to start doing like more one-off rebuild videos so I think the plan is we're gonna do one of those in the next few days now the last one we did was Manchester United I think the next team is either gonna be in the Prem or the Championship Definitely one of those two leagues, I think. And last one, Holland is glitched in FC24. Yeah, for some reason, whenever we play him the ball, he just kind of stands there, doesn't do anything. What if you guys said he gets stuck in like a power shy animation? The weird thing is, it's not all the time. Sometimes he gets the ball and he shoots and he scores, but he does some very weird things in this game. Someone also said that maybe he doesn't want to score off Ronaldo's assists, which hey, that could be true too. Now, like I said last episode, we're basically done with upgrades because right now Ronaldo is maxed out. At this height and position, this pretty much is maxed out stats for uh, player crew mode. I think today we're gonna go with these uh, kind of all white orange Nikes, which pretty much match the Real Madrid kit. All right, so the Ballon d'Or ceremony is in about a week and Ronaldo is a top three finalist. So we're going to find out if he does win his first ever Ballon d'Or, but we got one game to play before that. And it's kind of a big one against Villarreal because uh, right now we're sitting fourth. We are six points off Real Batiste in first who have not lost a game. So we got to start climbing this table right now. And uh, now that Ronaldo and Holland have decided to put aside their differences, actually like be teammates. It's been looking like this team is a new Real Madrid team because last two games we won in a really big fashion. So this could be the point where we truly save our season if these two can play together. So I want to see more of it. Ronaldo, good header to Holland. Holland, he's doing okay. That was actually a good pass he's only glitched sometimes it's so weird i don't know when he's glitched when he's not and all of those not glitch as he gets by him now i see a pass or a cross i'm gonna try to try to go for actually we might go for a shot ourselves okay that was so bad i was trying to fake out the keeper there all into ronaldo ronaldo to vinicius vinicius should shoot and oh that's deflected in that's an assist and just like that it's one nil to real madrid that quickly yeah ronaldo that's a great pass to vinicius and uh it's a bit of a lucky deflection but i'll take it okay great start one nil just like that is this team about to become the best team in la liga so with the players we have there's a chance that we might ronaldo fake shot now long shot shot it right at the defender hold up not done yet Vinicius into Ronaldo Ronaldo to Holland Holland oh man he almost shot that okay that was a decent chance Alverde Bellingham this is a very good passing we're gonna get it to Vardial Vardial could cross it does cross it Ronaldo diving header no that could have been 2-0 I thought that was almost perfect okay corner sent in Ronaldo is getting in the box for this that corner was terrible though Bellingham Ronaldo I want to go for a finesse shot we find the space finesse shot and it goes right to the keeper instead okay it's been a lively start I'll say that okay a little bit destroyed there a little bit Vardial back into Ronaldo Ronaldo going to try to find Bellingham who tries to shoot and it's a decent interception right there. Okay, not a bad attack by Villarreal. Not bad defense. Do your job, Chumeni. That is a, that was a good tackle. Somehow Diaz stayed with that though. Militao makes no tackle and now we can break Holland. Get it to Ronaldo. Now Ronaldo to Vinicius in space. Okay, Vinicius might be in here. Vinicius, get it back. Get it back. One pass to Ronaldo. Try to find some space and it's going to be blocked again. Man, that's a chance we got to take. We can't miss that. Look at the defensive work from Ronaldo. That was nice. Holland gets it to Valverde. Over to Mr. Ronaldo. He's going to stop. Wait for Holland. Wait. Into Erling. Gets it back. This is nice. Oh, that's a chance for a finesse shot. Oh, it was so good. The keeper's going to save it, though. They look like they're right on. Just like not enough power sometimes or not enough placement. They're not, uh, not good enough placement. Hey, Williams gets inside. They're going to tie it up. I feel like they might. That's a good block, though. Oh, we've got to take this to an elite here. Vinicius, play it. Okay, that was actually a great pass. He is onside. Arnar Martinez could cross it. Does cross it. Ronaldo. Oh, what a... Oh, man, it was nice finish, but it's right at the keeper. Literally shot it right at the keeper. I can't believe that. Ronaldo, wait for a better pass. Get it to Bellingham. Oh, man, that was not a good pass. Okay, we look good today. We just got to execute on these attacks and score the second goal. Because if we don't, they're going to tie this up, which they might hear. Nope, Militao. Oh, man, actually, I yeah, got to him still. That's a shot. That's blocked. And Ronaldo will try and clear it. Vardial. No, Vardial, that was timed so wrong. Okay, it was a lively first half. Only one goal to show for it. And this game is actually far from over. It's actually uh, pretty close still. Oh, Ronaldo goes around one. Try and go around another one. What a solo run no i went too close to the left that would have been so nice we've had so many like half chances this game hey bellingham good steal now we have space here ronaldo tries going one does go around one gets it out to martinez instead of martinez vinicius what a ball oh man i was right there for that pass vinicius gets to ronaldo out to vardial vardial back to ronaldo finesse shot by ronaldo and finally it's two nil and also finally ronaldo is back on the score sheet okay that's been coming for so long it's about time very simple just a finesse shot from ronaldo and it's two nil to real madrid definitely feel like the chemistry in this team is going up by the game oh holland you're making a great run into holland holland please okay he's not glitched right now 
he should score this. He should score this. Why did he take so long to shoot? I told him to shoot like probably a second before that. Oh man, that, that should be 3-0 right there. And also another Ronaldo assist. Now we also are going to enter the January transfer window in the episode. So there's a chance we can make changes. Play selling players, buying players. This team could look different by the end of the episode too. So it's kind of weird. We're in a weird part of the season, Ronaldo. Oh man, that was so bad. Okay, Diaz, great crossover to Moise Keen. Courtois, what a save though. That was beautifully done. Okay, we need another one. Courtois makes another save. He bobbles a little bit and he does collect it. Okay, right, Chabranko gets it over to Moise Keen again. And okay, they get one back and we got 15 minutes. The defense is a little bit of an issue here. I feel like we're just not consistent defensively. All right, if we score this third, though, it'll be fine. We'll win this game. If we don't, though, I'm a little nervous. They're going to tie it up. Holland, you should have scored that one chance. It's okay, though. I feel like we will score this third. Okay, Holland, what a pass that is. Get it to Vardial outside. Vardial, good touch there. Now, could play it back to Ronaldo. Does. Ronaldo, chance for... Another finesse shot. That one was good, but it was too much power. We got seven minutes. Miller out of the ball. And this is not making me up a comfortable shot. Courtois makes a very important save there. We cannot draw this game. Come on. It's been a good performance. We just need to not lose lead. Militao, what are you doing here? Making me nervous. Okay. Plays it over to Bellingham. Vinicius. Decent ball to Ronaldo. Ronaldo. No, that first touch was so heavy. We had to get to that, though. Ronaldo, we got three minutes. Trying to make something happen here towards the end of the game. We're going to try and cross it to Holland, which had her attempt. And it goes to the keeper. Not a bad chance. So we got two minutes added on. And we're going to try and just have a short corner here and try and waste a little bit of time. I'm going to call for it back. Just waste some time. Ronaldo, a chance to seal the game. Goes for the shot and that's deflected again. All right, same thing. Pass to Vinicius. Get it right back and we're going to try to do the same thing. Ronaldo looking for an angle. Finds the angle and it goes wide, but that is full time. Man, we could have scored like probably four or five goals this game. So yeah, we didn't have our shooting boost today as a team, but we still won. Still not playing our best, but that right there is a step in the right direction. Okay, now it is finally time though for the Ballon d'Or ceremony. So Ronaldo arrives at the event. As of course, once again, a top three finalist, which Fabrizio Romano tweets out saying the top three finalists for the Ballon d'Or are Erling Holland, Cristiano Ronaldo, and also Phil Foden. And then on stage is Lionel Messi, who will be presenting this year's Ballon d'Or award. Now, Messi says there's been a lot of great players this season, all deserving of recognition, but this award is for one player, the best player in the world. So he says, I'm honored to present this year's Ballon d'Or to Cristiano Ronaldo. That is right. Ronaldo wins his first ever Ballon d'Or, which that is exactly what Fabrizio Romano tweets. And also Ronaldo's stat line this year, scoring 73 goals, 16 assists, and also winning the FA Cup, winning the Premier League, and also winning the Champions League. Like what a season for Ronaldo. I mean, he was a clear favorite here. Now Ronaldo accepts the award. He says, thank you. When I started my career, I dreamt of this moment. And he says, I owe a lot to my teammates and coaches. Without them, I wouldn't be here. And he finishes his acceptance speech with a uh, so thank you. Now after this, Holland comes up to Ronaldo and he says, even though it hurts, you definitely deserved it this year. So congratulations. And Ronaldo says, thank you. I mean, hey, with Ronaldo's prolific style line this year, he was always the main favorite to win the Ballon d'Or. And hey, he can now say that he's the current best player in the world. So it is an absolutely huge achievement for him. I think now though, after that, I feel like Ronaldo's mindset has changed a little bit. After getting all the stats, after winning the Ballon d'Or, he's a bit more now like team focused, team oriented, not caring as much about being the best player. He wants to win. That's the most important thing to him. But I mean, hey, the Ballon d'Or definitely not going to hurt any confidence here. But okay, the first game after winning the Ballon d'Or is going to be against Frankfurt. Now, if we win this game, that does confirm us finishing up first in this group. So let's win this game, confirm that and get it done. And I mean, hey, first game after the Ballon d'Or ceremony, we got to prove, we got to show actually why Ronaldo won this Ballon d'Or. So at home, from the home fans, we should make some quick work of Frankfurt. We should. Okay, saying that, they're already in a little bit, which is a little bit worrying. In front of goal, gets to Castellanos and Reese James. Somehow that goes back to Courtois. Definitely looked a little shaky there. Oh, that dribble by Ronaldo was beautiful. Now we're going to play a long ball to Holland. Good pass. Holland gets it back to Ronaldo. Ronaldo to Valverde. Valverde goes for a shot. And that was maybe not the best choice. Maybe should have just took it ourselves there. Lucas Demetra turns. Looking dangerous here. Good tackle Valverde. Okay, defense. It's so weird. Like our players are very good. It's just the defense looks questionable. We've had teams with like worse defensive ratings, but better defensive play in game. It's just a little odd. Okay, Holland, you got space. He is running here. He's not glitched. Once again, oh man, as soon as I say that he lost the ball though, I just jinxed him. Island, I'm sorry. I just jinxed you. Not gonna lie. I think Frankfurt have had most possession here, which is uh, not a good sign. They look like the better team so far, which is not good. And that was a dangerous cross right there. Oh my, Ronaldo's pace is insane there. Oh, that's a foul too. That should definitely be a yellow card. Yeah, definitely. We would have had like a breakaway there. All right, swing it to the right back, Reese James. Vinicius Valverde. Now I'm going to try and get the ball. Top of the box here almost. Pass it to Holland. Holland can lay it off to someone. All right, slow and methodical. Find the best chance, Ronaldo. Gets that pass in stride. Now looking for something. Gets it back to Holland, who has time to shoot, but doesn't shoot fast enough. 
Valverde scores though instead. Bro, once again, Holland gets the ball and he's like so slow in shooting. I don't know why. But Valverde scores, so I'll take it. Holland gets the ball and you see, he is going for like a power shot or something. Some animation is slowing him down. But Valverde, it was actually a great finish off the chest and the volley. Okay, 1 0, 28th minute. Let's now keep this up. Okay, Reese James, what a pass to Ronaldo. That ball was insane. Okay, Vardio, I need you to run here. Vardio, now play it through. Good pass. Now Ronaldo is going to try to grow. Oh my, he just destroyed that defender again. Crossover to absolutely no one though. Header pass to Ronaldo. Lay it off to too many into Vinicius. I'm trying to find something. Okay, Vinicius should have passed it to uh, someone there. Did not just stand there. And they might score this. Castellanos gets it over to uh, Lucas Demetra. Thankfully, he's offside though. And we're kind of struggling against these teams, which like Villarreal teams we probably should beat more uh, comfortably. But it makes me nervous when the actual round of 16 comes. How are we gonna do against those teams, the really good teams? It makes me a little bit worried. Castellanos gets it to Demetra, and as I say that, they're gonna make it 1-1. Okay, if we enter January, the one thing I'm hoping for is maybe we sign a center back that could help us a lot. I feel like we're just not as good as we. We should be and okay that should be half time so uh one one it's tied up now i think if we draw we still guarantee first so that's good enough but it's really not actually good enough like no we need to win this game we can't get on the knockout stage like in bad form or uh bad confidence it's not a bad chance holland plays it to ronaldo ronaldo will try to find holland we'll find holland holland and he does the same thing again bro why is he glitched like i'm telling him to shoot and he won't shoot maybe i should try to not tell him to shoot and he'll actually shoot i don't even know the man is glitched though so many Vinicius, Ronaldo. We are now in Ronaldo. We'll get it over to Holland into Reese James and we are going to score. Okay, Ronaldo made the unselfish pass there to uh, to the right. So it's 2-1. I think we made the right choice. All right, leader stored. Let's now win this game. Once again, it's not been the easiest of games for us. Valverde, great ball to Vinicius though. Vinicius stops and shoots. Man, that ball was so good. Vinicius like stopped though. He should have went forward still. Martinez to Ronaldo. Ronaldo, good pass over to Bellingham into Holland. Vinicius. Oh, Vinicius was offside there. I thought he was going to play it to us. I mean, it looked like a good move there, but it just didn't work out. Ronaldo Ronaldo has a pass down the middle, maybe gets all the way to Valverde. Once again, a weird chance to shoot. And my the players in this team just act so weird, bro. They don't shoot and they don't act as normal as I'm expecting. Okay, Vinicius, as I'm saying that, will score. But like, I'll tell them to shoot and it looks like they get stuck in animation or something. I don't know. But 3-1, 74th minute, that might have won us this game. Hey, Ronaldo hasn't scored or assisted, but it's been a team performance here. We're not trying to be like a one-man uh, lone wolf anymore. Now, if they score this, they might get back in it, which that looks dangerous. And of course, they are going to score it and they're back in it. Just a weird free kick. It's 2-3. Okay, 15 minutes, one goal lead. We shall not lose this lead, though. Here we go, like six minutes. Our team is pressing them like crazy. They break out of it, though. Then there's room for them, which that is an interesting pass that does work. But thankfully, he's offside. All right, six minutes to just uh, survive here. Come on, don't let him score here. Don't let him score. Crossover, Mileto, right to Courtois. Two minutes left now. Okay, I think Holland's off for Rodrigo this time. Played it back, though. We may have survived the comeback. Vinicius out wide. Ronaldo calls for it. Gets Ronaldo into Rodrigo. That pass was not that good from us. Okay, definitely wasn't our best best game individually but as a team we played well other than the defense maybe so once again we got the job done in the end although it wasn't that convincing like this team still needs work if you want to be the best team in the world definitely needs work all right so after a decent run in la liga we're now up to second place in the league uh five points off the leaders in real batiste who are still unbeaten 20 games in now our next game is uh it's it's quite a big one it is the el Clasico once again this time at the bernabeu now ronaldo is now second in scoring in la liga and in terms of our former teammate phil foden he's got seven goals and nine assists in uh, 19 games that's not bad which speaking of him before this game in the tunnel phil foden and sees Ronaldo and says, hey, I'm about to get you back for the Ballon d'Or. I can't let you win again. And Ronaldo says, oh yeah? We'll see about that. So once again, Barca versus Real Madrid, the El Clasico. Now, I think last time we either won by one goal or we drew. I can't remember. It was close though. So we'll see if this time is any different. We know they have a pretty good team. Darwin Nunez, they got Savage, uh, they got Rashford, Foden, of course. So it's a very big test for this team before the uh, knockout stage of Champions League begins. Yeah, I'm seeing uh, Cucurella. That's a new signing. I think a left back. Not sure we need a new left back, but you know what? I'm cool with that. Now, Holland plays a actually a very good ball to Ronaldo. Could keep it in. Oh man. And just hit a little bit too much there. I don't mind uh, the idea though. Now, Bono Nunez gets it to Rashford, who should get tackled here. Doesn't get tackled. Falls to a Foden instead. Foden, we know he wants to score a goal today. Rashford shot that's right at Courtois, but has a lot of power on it. Now, Courtois with a great throw to Ronaldo though. Okay, this could be good. Valverde back to Ronnie. Ronnie gonna try to get around, I think, uh, Marquinhos here. Okay, find a better pass. Find it. Find it. Into Vinicius. What a pass, Vinicius. We'll try and do something here. No, Vinicius. We got to be more decisive than that. Okay, Holland crossover to not Ronaldo. Man, that was such a good chance. Vinicius, we just, uh, so much indecisiveness sometimes in the attack. Nunez, Vardy, okay, that was very dangerous. Thankfully, we survived that. First 20 minutes have been, uh, have been pretty even here. Man, I'm worried. Like, we face these big teams and, like, we, we struggle. Okay, as I say that, good tackle on Trent. No, Holland, please, Holland, please. I think we're on side. So, we got Vinicius, far post. Vinicius, I am crossing it to you. 
Good cross. Vinicius header attempt, and that's 1-0 to Real Madrid. So much for the struggling. Ronaldo assists, a great cross, and a great goal by Vinicius. And Ronaldo just draws three defenders. Like, look at that. They were so much worried about the Ballon d'Or winner that they forgot about Vinicius' far post. Okay, 1-0, I think like a 25th minute. Been even, but 1-0 to Madrid. Savage goes for a shot. Courtois, good save. That could be tie game right there. That's a big save. Duncan Salo looking dangerous. Gets it back to Marcus Rashford. Pedri into Nunez, but Courtois will grab it. Yeah, this game is extremely close. These are two good teams right now. Courtois, though, with a Another great throw to Ronaldo. Ronaldo versus Trent. Ronaldo versus Trent. Okay, hold up, hold up. We need help here. Trying to be more smart. That is smarter right there. Okay, get it back to Cucurella. Into Holland. Holland. Get it to Ronaldo. Good pass. Try and spread the defense. Now Cucurella. Back to Ronaldo. Finesse shot that is deflected out to Vinicius, though. Vinicius, cross it. Okay, he doesn't cross it. Goes to Bellingham instead, who shoots, and Ter Stegen will save that shot. All right, short corner. Vinicius. Back to Ronaldo. Now that five star weak foot. Will it come in handy? We're gonna hit the crossbar. You gotta be kidding me. Man, Holland ducked perfectly over that shot, but it hits the crossbar. Okay, half time. It's one. No, we definitely could be like 2-0 up right now, or it could be 1-1. That is how close this El Clasico is right now. We got a very big 45 minutes ahead of us here. And Ronaldo is looking to have a good start second half. Okay, Marquinhos, Marquinhos. Get destroyed there, kind of. Ronaldo then finesse shot. Ronaldo into the top right hand corner. Okay, that is how you start a second half right there. Just Marquinhos gets uh, destroyed there a little bit. And then Ronaldo finesse shot from almost outside of the box. And that thing just goes literally top right hand corner. Gabi Alonso is loving it. Okay, 2 0. Big goal in this game. Let's keep it up. Hey, Vinicius, he just stole that. Hold up. Vinicius into Ronaldo, who's in. Ronaldo, four. A quick two goals, and Ter Stegen is going to make the save. I am going to throw up. Crossed in by Ronaldo. That is going to be actually Militao, but that actually wasn't that good. Militao, Ronaldo. Okay, wait, wait. Relax. Everyone relax. Marquinhos, can you relax a little bit? I'm trying to find a better pass here. Okay, this is good. This is good. This is very good. Vinicius. Vinicius is indecisive as always. Man, they're just so indecisive, this front three. They, like, never know what to do with it if they have space and time. I mean, so much for what Foden said. He's been uh, quiet this game. He's got the arrow above his head, though, so I know if he gets the ball, he's going to be dangerous. I'm marking for Foden. I will not let him score. Oh, what a tackle by Ronaldo. That was beautiful on Trent. Now we can break from this. Man, they don't see us, though. They got to see us more often there. Ronaldo will feed in Holland Marquinhos. That was a good steal. I should have played it over the top. All right, 20 minutes, 2 0 lead. We're in a good spot. But if they score here, then we're not in a good spot. I see he gets it to Trent. I am marking Foden. Okay, that goes to Pedri, though. That's a crossover to Ferran Torres, who shoots. Courtois, though, decent save. And Courtois has had a very good episode. Oh, that was that Foden? Foden just tried to take out Ronaldo. Look at him. You gotta be kidding me. He knows what he did there. You know what you did. He gets a yellow card. Foden, that was that was very, very. As the commentator just said, it was a silly challenge. Look at him. He's frustrated. Whoa, he went, he went both feet into that tackle. That is rough, my friend. Ronaldo's mad now. We're gonna make him feel that tackle. We are gonna make him feel it on the score. Line. Okay, hold up, hold up. Marquinhos stops. Gonna play it to Kemavinga. Oh man, I was in a good spot there for a pass. But again, they always play the wrong pass here, Real Madrid. Hey, Ronaldo has space here, Holland. Get out the way holland you're glitch I, I don't need you here ronaldo is gonna try to cut inside will try and stop here stays with it somehow Dread goes for a shot and of course it's gonna be blocked bro like our teammates make the wrong passes i'm trying to do something for the team here maybe a little bit selfish but they're not making the right pass so i kind of have to be Vinicius. okay steve makes a good pass here okay that's a great move but oh Vinicius. then the pass was terrible though he did such good work there but he literally gave it to no one this honestly is like one of the glitchiest teams i've ever played on in any player career i think they just do things that are very weird okay darwin nunez Vardial, good defending there it's just so weird all right ball to frank garcia holland frank garcia get it to ronaldo good pass there that was good now ronaldo looking to seal this game he's got no stamina though no stamina at all gets it to holland and that is three nil to real madrid that is game set match nil classico once again if we can click in this team if everyone's on the same page there's not that many glitches going on we can be a really good team ronaldo made the right pass again holland it was a very good first time finish okay when he shoots like that he's really good i just need more of that all right barcelona came to our home and we took care of business today so there's a very good way to enter the uh, most important part of our season the champions league knockout stage the title race area so that right there is a very good win if we want to win trophies this year though we got to keep it up and get even better so that means we are now two points off the unbeaten real batiste and of course we topped our champions group as well so we look in decent form heading into the most important part of our season the biggest part of our season and right now ronaldo's got 28 goals and 16 assists so he's doing the job scoring assisting with his teammates he's kind of doing everything now a few days later after the el clasico though ronaldo meets with his coach chabi alonso and ronaldo says now that i've won a ballon d'or become what i want it to be the best player in the world i realize that's not exactly what i want the most i want to win trophies be a good teammate and if i'm still recognized as the best player after all that then i'm doing something right and chabi says i like to hear that we're about to enter the most important part of our season and i think this team is ready to try and make a push to win trophies which that'll be in the next episode so if you want to see more then drop a like and if you want to watch the latest spider-man 2 playthrough episode over on my other channel then click on screen to watch that